Hello there friends, welcome to our channel Organized by Dorsey. In today's video, I'll be cleaning and reorganizing our pantry for 2022. If you're new here, welcome. My name is Dorsey and I do weekly organizational videos here on this channel. In my last video, I mentioned that during the month of February, I'm going to be focusing on every area in our kitchen and the pantry is the first in the series. Let's get started. Come with me. If you like organizational videos, may I suggest that you press that subscribe button below for weekly organizational videos. Also, if you press the bell icon, which is right beside the subscribe button, you'll be one of the first to be notified when new videos are uploaded weekly. Now, let's really get started with cleaning and organizing this pantry. Welcome to our pantry. Today I'm going to be taking everything out, wiping down all the areas, and repacking everything in. It should only take me perhaps an hour, an hour and a half the most. Because I clean my pantry every three or so months. So it shouldn't be very difficult. And as you can see, it's pretty organized right now, but it needs cleaning. And that's what I'm going to be working on right now. This is the before. And we'll look at the after in just an hour or so. I've emptied all the shelves, wiped them down, and now I'm going to repack the items in. I have tear trays for the canned goods, and then I also have some Lazy Susans or the turntables for some of the heavy items that I'll put here at the bottom. So let's take a look at this in just a few more minutes. Everything is clean and ready to be repacked. Just about everything that's in a bottle is here on the island at the cooktop here. So we'll pack everything back. Everything has been wiped off, clean, and ready to go back inside the pantry.
this is the reveal of the pantry as cleaned for early 2022. Let's take a look from the very top. We have on the first shelf, we have chicken stock, vegetable broth, almond grease, and right behind the almond grease, we have coconut milk. Then we have from Costco, these large containers with um, seasoning. Then right below that shell, on shelf number two, it's mostly, these are mostly on tiered trays. So the first one has all the soups. And the next tray, next tiered tray has all the beans. We have black beans, organic green northern beans, three, be three bean salad, cut green beans, and to the right we have the miscellaneous tear tray that has asparagus spears, crushed pineapple, mandarin oranges, and tuna. In the middle here we also have some sardines and those are from Costco so that's why there's so many there. Then the next tray down or the next shelf down shelf number three is where we have lots of bottles with um the different types of beans turmeric powder organic red quinoa white quinoa organic dried figs salad topping and lots and lots of beans on this lazy susan we have garbanzo flour almond flour this container has organic white quinoa. Over here, the front, we have walnut, almonds, and organic chia seeds. In the very back here, we have a Lizzie Susan with all the oils and sprays that we use. So that's in the very back here. And the Further down, we're on shelf number four, where we have pasta cauliflower, and we have all all-purpose flour, almond flour, lots of almond flour, coconut flour, and more peas. Over to the right here, we have more pretty much the same but instead of being in bottles they're in these containers they've had for a very very long time this one has 15 bean soup all the different types of beans are in these containers here and at the very bottom towards the floor we have this lazy susan that has and this is from costco the, the presto sauce so those are the ones from Costco. And we have more beans. And on the floor, we have this container that has the Reynolds wrap and some other bags. And then on the floor also, we have these cases of mandarin oranges. To the right here on the floor, we have these containers or these little baskets with some extra water. This one has I think apple cider vinegar, extra waffles there. So this is what our pantry looks like after it's been cleaned and organized for 2022. Let's take a final look from top to bottom. Over on this side, we left out this little area here. It has some extra seasoning. These are just back stock because the regular seasoning are kept in a drawer outside. We have more coconut flour, of course, and more beans. So this is what the pantry looks like from both angles, from top to bottom, from right, or from left to right. What's your story? What's your sign? It's like we're twin flames in a different life. Deep connection.
Thank you so much for watching. I am so excited that you took the time today to watch this video. I hope you're motivated to clean and organize your pantry as well. I'm really looking forward to next week when we are in part two in the series and we'll see you then. Take care, I'll see you next week. Goodbye and of course, good luck. What's your weakness? What's your type? Somehow I 